Welcome to this video tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn how to use the convert entities. From previous tutorial, we learned how to make planes through reference geometry. I'm going to show you two different ways of using the convert entities. The first way is going to be through plane. Go reference geometry, select plane. Select this edge here. Select this face, select angle, and select flip offset. Select OK. Click on this surface here, select sketch. Select the circle tool on the origin, smart dimension. 10. Features, extrude cut, through all, OK. Now, click on this plane that we just create, and select sketch. Right now, we are going to sketch on this plane. Our surface now, our geometry, is this plane here. So let's say that I want to create a pipeline from this plane to this hole here. Select Convert Entities and select this circle and press OK. Select Extrude Boss. Go to Blind and select Up to Surface. Select this face. Go to Thin Feature. Press 1 mm. Enter and select OK. Now, expand this extrude thin, select this sketch, edit sketch, select the circle. As you can see, this circle has a relation which is called on edge. On edge means that this line, this geometry, this sketch entity is corresponding to this line here, to another line. So by updating this line, this circle is going to be updated as well. So whatever value I choose here is going to affect this circle as well. Let's go to have a look. Press OK. Exit sketch. So uh, I'm going to edit this circle here. Click here. Double click on this value. And press 25. Click on Rebuild, and as you can see, this circle updated based on this reference circle here. So now, the second way that I want to show you is by creating another sketch on this surface. So click on this surface, select Sketch. Select the corner rectangle on the point, click here, press escape key on the keyboard, select this line, hold control key, select this line here, and make them collinear. Smart dimension, press escape, smart dimension, select this line 
Fantil. Features, extrude balls. Reverse direction. Doesn't matter the value here. I just want to show you the process. Okay. So I would like to do the same thing on this surface here as well. On this surface. So what I do is click on this surface, sketch, select this line, hold down the control key on the keyboard, select this line, this line, and this line as well. Select convert entities. So as you can see, and just create another on edge relation on this surface here. So whatever value I choose here, for example, if I make any change on this surface that we just create on this feature, this edge is going to change based on this reference. Let's go back to the convert entities again to show you something interesting. Press undo. Now we are in sketch environment. We haven't exited the sketch at the moment. So we are still on this surface here, on this level. Click on this graphic area on the background. Convert entities. And now you can simply click on this surface. You can have the same result as well. If you made a mistake by choosing the wrong surface, go back and deselect this highlight surface here. Or you can go back and press delete. Or you can right click on the mouse button and select delete. So let's click on this surface here and select OK. Features, extrude boss. Reverse direction. OK. Thanks for watching. See you next time.